Hello, this is Mike with Maritech, and I'm here today to show you how to replace the cylinder idler bearings in a clean tech hand washing system. This is a fairly simple process that should take just a few minutes to do. Let's get started by identifying the tools and parts you will need. One, a 3 8 inch nut driver. Two, a 5 16 nut driver. Three, Phillips head screwdriver. Four, pliers, five, five each of cylinder idler bearings, six gloves, seven clean rag. Unplug the hand washing system, remove the soap door and top cover, remove cylinder drive belts and cylinders. Pointing to bearings, identify cylinder hold down bearings versus cylinder idler bearings. It really doesn't matter which bearing you remove first, but you do need to retain the washers with each bearing because we'll need them for the new one, so let's take care when we remove the old bearings. Remove all idler bearings. Clean the surface of the idler bearing plate. First, Let's put the nylon bearing inserts into the bearings. For the cylinder idler plate bearings, they get a washer, bearing, washer, and lock nut. We want the washer spacers on both sides of the bearing in order for the bearing to rotate freely. Don't over tighten these nuts as they'll restrict bearing rotation. For the cylinder, hold down the bearing. The orientation is place washer over screw, idler bearing next, followed by another washer. Insert assembly into cylinder, hold down bracket and add the final washer and then the locking nut. Return cylinders to hand washing system and give them a good press down to ensure full engagement. Put cylinder drive belts back on and rotate cylinders to ensure everything is rotating smoothly. Put the top cover and soap door back on. Plug in the system. As you can see, replacing idler bearings is pretty easy and if you have any difficulty, please just give us a call.